everyone, today's 411, I have account manager Sarah Ferrante with me, and we're gonna go over some common ask questions about director opportunities. Hi Sarah, thanks for joining. How long have you worked with Arias? I've worked for Arias for nine years this month. That's awesome, such a long tenure, that's great. Um, what are direct hire opportunities and who is, who is eligible for direct hire opportunities? So direct hire opportunities are full-time permanent positions, more long-term versus the travel assignments are more uh, short-term, 13-week assignments. So direct hire opportunities, the candidate will work directly for the facility, whereas travel assignments, the candidate will work for Arius Medical. Um, as far as who's qualified, the education piece is gonna be the biggest thing. So for med techs and histology techs, Oftentimes that's gonna be an associate's degree or bachelor's degree. However, um, on the job training or military training does often qualify as well. And then um, the certification is also another piece that most facilities do require or at least eligibility for to get the certification. Um, other than that, all, all levels of experience are great, um, including new graduates. Where are the direct like where are the direct hire locations located at? So we do have jobs in every state across the United States, but basically if there's any specific location that a candidate wants to go to or relocate to, then we can uh, market and make calls into our clients and help open something up for them. Can you tell me a little bit about the process of obtaining a direct hire position with Arius? What is it like? The candidate will start with filling out an online application and um, we'll talk to them about their preferences for location and shift and things like that. And then upon su submitting them to a facility that they're interested in, we'll set, set up a phone interview to start. And if that goes well, oftentimes the facility will wanna do an on-site interview or a Skype interview. Um, however, sometimes the facility will offer the candidate the position after just the phone interview. Um, from there, uh, being that the candidate will work directly from the facility, for the facility, they'll do, um, you know, all of the pre-hire stuff, um, and we will help with the logistics such as relocating and getting them resources to find housing. Um, regarding the relocation, oftentimes the facilities do help with that cost. Um, however, it's going to be over the first couple of paychecks. So the candidate does need to be financially prepared to relocate because those costs are not covered up front. What about if somebody who is who takes a direct hire opportunity with Arias, but then um, they wanna travel down the road? Is that something that somebody can do or a candidate can do? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, we have that happen a lot. Um, you know, uh, we try to have a candidate be able to commit to uh, one to two years for a direct hire position. Um, however, you know, we are going to be able to stay in touch and if the timing lines up to start traveling again, that's always a possibility. Um, another thing that happens a lot is uh, new graduates. We place them in a permanent job, they get their year or two of experience and then they get to meet their goal of traveling. Um, and then the other thing that we offer is temp to perm positions where someone is, starts as a traveler at a, con, at a facility and that leads to a direct hire position. So that's another possibility as well if, this, if the candidate would feel better about trying out the position before committing to a direct hire opportunity. Thank you so much again, Sarah, for joining and thanks for tuning in. If you have any further questions on how to apply to direct hire opportunities with Arias, reach out to me today. And if you haven't already, check out our Facebook groups. The links are listed above.